Hey guys, World of Lewis here, and today we've got another video for you guys. And as you can see, where we are, well, you can't really tell this time because we're not in front of the brick wall. We've not moved house. We're just at a different setting. As you can see, we're behind the bush. Stupid bush. Right. So we've got a match day vlog for you guys today, as per usual watching my vids guys i'm sure you're gonna be thrilled with another match day vlog today right guys so yeah let's just get on with the video right guys so we've got premier league action again today um and we're playing a team that is um as you well probably know is the worst team in the league they've had six defeats loads of players injured and we should just beat them today, to be honest. And that team today is Crystal Palace. Yeah, we welcome Crystal Palace today to Old Trafford, in which is going to be, I shouldn't say easy game. I'm not sure what's going to happen because we've got injuries, Palace have got injuries, and you never know with Man United. So, that's guys, Roy Hodgson back to Old Trafford, I'll say back to Old Trafford, I'm not sure when he last came to Old Trafford, but the crazy frog as well that didn't fly 360 miles from England, uh, sorry, Wembley to Scotland. No, he's travelling about, what, wait, um, 200 miles from Selhurst Park to Old Trafford. Yes, guys, without further ado, let's just get that team news in. I know, guys, I'm not Gary Lineker or Conor McNamara or anyone like that. All right, so... The team news are from Manchester United, Carrick, Pogba, Rojo and Ibrahimovic are all absent. Jones, Valencia, Fellini and Marshall will be assessed. That's it for United for Crystal Palace. Benteke will be out for six weeks with a knee injury. Loftus-Cheek is injured. James Tompkins is ill. And Tim Fossey Mensah cannot play against his parent club because he is on loan. Uh, and shout-outs today. Hopefully, guys, you've been all waiting for this. So, shout-outs to Marcel Krinsky. Coffee Victorine, Adam Blinston, DB Fab Football, Bijaya Pandey, Ma Mahmoud Ayub, Chris Johnson, Joe Diaz, and Treasure the Cat. James, who lives in Manchester, Scott Kent, Mickey, Preston Rajkuma, Niam Said, Ben Leons, Ethan Hagen, Finn Everything, Fred Nut Seven, JCMKHD, William Lesser123, Jeremy Kidney Ramdas at MUFC Jack. Hopefully I've pronounced them right. If you comment below, I'll just um, yeah, I'll just say sorry to you guys because yeah, that's just the way it goes. Uh, and if I have missed anyone uh, out of this list that did comment below for this game, then you will be shouted out in the next game. Uh, and if you're also new to the channel, comment below and you will get a shout out in the next vlog. So yes guys, that's it for team news. Other than that, kickoff is at 1500. Three o'clock to be precise. First three o'clock kickoff for United at Old Trafford. And um, yeah, very nice. So yeah, we'll be going to Fat Jackets, the place where potatoes always go. I don't know where that woman is. I'm sorry guys, uh, I really do miss her. Said he was going to get her on the video, but she's just sometimes just disappeared. She might have got sacked. Yeah, she probably had behind me, Freezing to be honest. Three tins of potatoes at work. Yeah. Um, but that doesn't stop us from eating that hot and healthy potato that takes 15 minutes to bake in slow baked potatoes. And after we've done that, we'll be off to Old Trafford, the theatre of dreams, to see Manchester United versus Crystal Palace in a crucial Premier League game. So yes guys, let's do this on another match day vlog. Boom. Let's go this way to the car.
right, guys. You know what's happening. That's good. Right, guys. You know what is happening. Let's go on that bridge and let's walk to the Theatre of Dreams via Claude. Let's go. Here's our music man on match days. Good man, good man, you're right, Steve. Yeah, you mate. Not too bad, thank you. Bit bit should be another whitewash today. Yeah. <laughs> bit of a croaky throat today. For Lewis. There you go, sir. Cheers. Thank you very much, mate. Sir. Thank you. Much appreciated. Here we are. Right, 
Alright guys, let's have a look at our view. Right guys, let's have a look at today's teams. Uh, now with World of Lewis Dad. What's your prediction this afternoon? Uh, I, I predict by the, the end of the day that we'll be uh, on top of the league with City getting beaten or drawing against uh, Chelsea later on. But I don't know. On paper, obviously, six, six defeats and not very many goals scored, if any at all, would suggest that this game's going to be quite easy but you know you can't tell can you no you can't. i know my predictions have been quite decent this season but this one i could quite easily say five six still but yeah you're only as good as what happens on the day you know we had a trip to moscow midweek uh we've got a few niggling injuries rumors that lukaku might be injured so uh having said that you know we've got enough strength to overcome palace uh, Palace have got a few a few out injured. They haven't really got a recognisable strike force with Benteke. Uh, he's out. Zaha's out. Uh, Loftus Cheeks out. I think they've only got one guy, Lapida, Lapida, or whatever his name is, up front. So yeah, on paper it looks comfortable. But you know, we've seen us getting beat before in these situations. But hey, I'm positive as always. I'm going. I, I keep saying four 0 uh, but I am, I'm going to go 4-0. What do you think? It could be any score because, you know, it could be like Burton, it could be 6-0, it could be 5-1, it could be 1-0, it could be anything. Uh, but I'm going straight to my prediction, I'm going to go with the 3-0 United. I think we'll win uh, very comfortably uh, like we did in Moscow. I mean, Moscow was just... Uh, you know. It's a shame that we didn't give, keep a clean sheet, but hey, I'm being yeah, a bit... Yeah, but you know... You can't have everything in life, can you see? Yeah, so... Um, if, if Three points, a few goals, top yeah. of the league, I'll take that. With the City, of course, playing Chelsea, which I'm actually going for a City win, although... I think that'll be a one-all. Obviously, really Aguero's done his ribs in. Uh, but Morata's on fire, so... Yeah, you know, Ultimately, can... Can City contain Morata and Batshuayi, who's now, now, uh, you know, he's making more of an appearance this season with Costa going. So, you know, it'll be a good game. But hey, I'm not talking about them. I'm talking about United. So, yeah. we need to prediction: on today. three nil, four nil. Let's do this. See who, who's going to get it right. Who is going to get it right? On another match day vlog. Sure. Boom. Mkhitaryan's eyes.
Like I said before the game, you know, this is an easy fixture really. When you look at what Palace are doing in the league, uh, they are where they are. The results just uh, just tell you the story. We don't score any goals and we haven't scored any goals in the first half. We made it look very easy. A couple of well taken goals, we've you know, had a couple of more chances. We've knocked the ball around, we've looked sharp. What more can you say? It's 2-0. 
Yeah. We're, we're getting into prediction territory shortly. Not much to say, really. Um, good first half. They've Palace loads of. Uh, they've had opportunities yeah, they've had to streak some passes together, Palace, but yeah. they've got no quality. They've loads of little great skills. Uh, yeah, we, we've just been knocking it around. Matt Matter had a little skill. Uh, Two Fellaini. goals, two well taken goals. Yeah, Fellaini's um, been uh, been tidy. Yeah. yeah we, we've just been comfortable, really. Yeah. And we can continue to the second half and not what we not want to do. It's the last game. We've got like, scored like three in the first half and we scored one in the second half. I really, really, really Let's don't Let's try and keep that. a clean sheet, but we need to beef, beef up our goal, goal difference. Yeah. And it's an opportunity uh, to do that today. Yeah, so. we're about four off City, aren't we? Yeah. So this is a good chance to uh, put three or four or five past them, get on City, and for City to, to uh, come unstuck later. Let's get back on top of the league. Anything come, on. Else? No. come on, United. Hopefully, the second half is interesting. Yes, guys. Come on, United.
Pani to.